Hi everybody, it's Anthony from ComicsEatingUp.net. I'm back with Terry Hockness from Hockness.Comics.com. We're doing our new comic spec review video for June 7th, 2017. Before we get into the spec picks, let's go ahead and talk about some of the news this week. Probably the biggest bit of casting news this week was Odette Annabelle was cast as Rain on the Supergirl TV show. Now, Rain's a relatively new character who appeared in uh, Supergirl number 5, New 52. Uh, prices on that book started shooting up this week. The winner of this week was definitely the Spawn 1 per store variant. It started off at about 119 bucks and quickly shot up to about 170 bucks as of last check. So that's pretty good if you're able to secure one very cheap or um, get it for free like I did. Uh, very happy with that pickup. So let's go ahead and turn it over to Terry for the spec picks this week. Okay, here's some of the regular covers out this week that I'm going to give thumbs up because I think these are ones you should take a chance and gamble on. Um, these have the best chances of any of the books out this week, and there's a lot of books out this week, the first week of June. The first one is Baby Teeth from Aftershock, small print. Um, a lot of the titles for this book get a lot of buzz, so this one's worth checking out. Baby Teeth number one is the obvious pick of the week. Um, and it's a fantastic read. I've read issues one and two, and I really enjoyed it. The downside of it is there's about 20 different variant covers for the book. Um, that many books, it's going to saturate the market a bit. Stick with the regular cover or the uh, Elizabeth Torque variant cover. Both of these could be the winners of the week. My big pick of the week is Divided States of Hysteria. Number one, this is a new series from Image Comics. We know it's going to sell out. We know the print run will not be too high. This is a new Howard Chaikin series. Not everybody likes him, but... I think this one's got a pretty controversial topic line, so I think this one's worth picking. Horror has a comic out this week uh, called Orgasmageddon, number one. Um, Gore books have done really well in the secondary market. If you check um, Gore comics on eBay, you'll see that they go for a good bit of money. Gore has a loyal following, so this one could definitely be the winner of the week as well. Walking Dead 168 is the latest issue. We always recommend that every month because you never know if something big's going to happen. Well, it's got two covers. Uh, Walking Dead variant covers are normally sought after. This one is a Pride cover. Um, it's a good looking cover. It's going to be worth a pickup, definitely. Um, this could have the crossover potential um, because of it being a Pride cover itself. So you might find extra buyers for it that wouldn't normally buy um, a, a Walking Dead book. One of my big picks of the week uh, is Harvey Hits number one from Joe Books. This is an all-ages company, and it brings the return of the classic characters Richie Rich, Casper the Ghost, and Wendy the Good Little Witch. So this could be really fun, a long-term pick, and you know the print run's going to be small on this one. Frank Cho's back with Harley Quinn number 21. It's another more innocent cover from Frank Cho with Harley swinging on a swing. Very cutesy, uh, very funny, very nice. Um, less cheesecake than he's normally known for, but these Harley Quinn books are being snagged up. Another interesting book, MIC Publishing gives us Marvel Comics Digest number one. This is a digest size comic. It features classic reprints of Spider-Man. Spider-Man featured on the cover, hefty cover price. This is going to get unnoticed by a lot of people. This could be a surprise hit. Unsound number one is out from Colin Bunn. Um, Cullen has um, had a successful string of turning comic books into uh, movie and TV adaptations. While none of them have hit the screen yet, these options often lead to um, you know increases in price. So definitely keep uh, so definitely keep Unsound Number One on your so definitely keep Unsound Number One on your watch list this week. And Solar Flare gets a second printing. Number one had a lot of buzz, and of course the second printing could be even smaller print run. If the buzz continues, this could be an easy pick for a quick flip. Lots of other great books out this week, but those are my highlights. You can see how I... The Mary Jane variants start this week. Uh, we get Guardians 3, Chris Anka, the Star-Lord homage. Avengers 8 has a Mike Allred Vision cover. This is a great looking cover, and I like Mike Allred. Black Bolt 2 has Mary Jane as Black Bolt, and the cover's by Ryan Stegman. Champions 9 has a Nova cover. Daredevil 2 has an Umberto Ramos uh, Daredevil Mary Jane cover. Just don't like the way he draws anymore. And probably the best looking cover this week is the Iron Fist Stephanie Hans. Um, Mary Jane is Iron Fist cover. The spec book for variants this week is definitely the Zombies Assembled number two Greg Horn cover. It's already selling out online. It's a great looking cover. Very creepy um, Black Widow with uh, zombified uh, features um, sitting in the shadows. So it's definitely a good looking book. Rank all the rest from one to ten for the likelihood that I think that they're going to heat up and go up in price. Well, that's it for us this week. Please let us know what you're specking on. If you're watching on YouTube, please uh, give us the thumbs up button. We definitely appreciate that. Or leave a comment. If you're watching on comicsheatingup.net, please feel free to chime in and tell us what you're specking on. And, uh, you know, as always, leave a comment. Thanks for watching, everybody.